Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to make vegetarian egg rolls today. If you don't have a taro or glass noodle, you could just use carrots and cabbage, as long as they add, the vegetable add up to 2 pounds. Which is the glass noodle, clear noodle, vermicelli. We need 100 grams. 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 We need And you need a bag of coleslaw salad, which is one pound. Or you can chop them yourself, but I don't want to do that. So um, I just bought the one that they already made at the grocery store. You need one pound of taro. You slice them small. If you don't have taro, you can use potato. And Just chop them like that. We need about um, 10 stem of uh, cilantro and about 2 stem of the green onion. Now you can add the black pepper, salt, sugar, chicken broth powder, chicken broth powder make it full, heaping, half teaspoon. Sometime if you want to chop uh, ginger, to put in there, you can do that too. Most of the restaurant they put the uh, sesame oil in it, about uh, one tablespoon, one teaspoon, one teaspoon of sesame oil. If you like the smell of ta the sesame, if you want to add meat, you can add meat also. You can chop a uh, shrimp and put in there. Or you can have ground pork or ground chicken mix in the vegetable. You peel it gently, otherwise it will break. I use egg to seal it at the end after I roll the egg roll. While you cook the oil to heat up the oil you can roll your egg roll now one full tablespoon you roll it a little bit and then you fold one side and then roll a little bit more and fold it again don't fold it at the same time fold and seal completely I poke the yolk of the egg because the yellow part of the egg seal better I forgot to tell you, when you put the oil heating, you put about two quarts of oil. To test the oil, whether it's hot or not, you just press the chopstick in there. If it's bubbling, that means it's hot enough.
You cook it until it's golden brown. If you don't intend to eat all of these in uh, the same day, you can just uh, make it about that color and then you can take it out and keep it, save it in the freezer so you can put it in a toaster about 10 minutes. If you want to eat right away, make sure it's that color, that brown. It's a little bit darker so they get crispier. Now all the egg rolls are done. This is my homemade uh, sriracha. I made myself uh, the sauce. When you make yourself, you control the spiciness. You don't want to be too hot because when you bought it at the store, they make it too spicy sometimes. If you want to know how to make the sriracha sauce, let me know in the comment section. I will show you how to do homemade. The sriracha I made was about five months ago. You can keep it up to a year. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoy my vegetarian.